dig in, shall we? Let's see what we got. First thing, well, first off, cool little sticker. I usually put these on like my tackle boxes or my hard box or whatever, you know. They cool. That's probably a good way to catch me. Now, second thing up, big bite baits, creature baits. I love these things. I've been fishing with big bite baits for a while now, since like maybe 2008, I think. Maybe 2007 I've been fishing with these. And these are awesome. I love them. Ooh, good color too. Creature bait. Kind of look like a brush hog that Zoom made. Works fit just as good. good That's like maybe a three dollar bait right there. Ah. Next up, Z Man's. Trick shorts. Little shots. I don't know why I said shorts, but quick shots. <laughs> I've used these once before in my lifetime, and they were okay. They actually did good. Feel good. Yeah, these should knock like smallmouth bass out the water. Like for real. Nice size jig head on there. Maybe even a circle hook. This should do it. This should really do it. I'm loving that color though, you know that. The color is something nice. I like this. That's like what? Let's see. That's a. Price uh, card right here. That's a three dollar bait right there. Just bad. Next, we got ah, something that I actually really, really needed. Really needed. Boom. Drop shot hooks. <clears throat> I love using drop shot hooks because they're easy to set. they small. And you can take your time with them and you can use them for panfish, bass, whatever. Nice size little hook right here. Real good size hook. I like this. I like it a lot. Oh, and they sharp. Straight from Carl. They work good. I know they do. The last ones that I got in my mystery tackle box were excellent. I'm mad that I lost almost all. Actually, I lost them all. Sucks. Now. Ah. Carl's amazing golden boy. Square bill crank. This is going to knock largemouth bass and pike out the water. I already know. These things, Carl so far has not let me down when it came to square bills, when it came to any crankbait, really. So I'm liking this. And this right here is an $8 bait. Yup, $8. Then we come to the big boy here. Boom. Strike Pro. Suspend it. Jerk bait. Love these things. Stay in that water column for as long as you need them to. So if you give it a little bit of working action, twerking action, make that booty jiggle a little bit. You hear that? They make hooks. There we go. That's the rattle. You got rattles on the inside of them. It draws the fish in. I love these. Say it's turning me gray. I'm gonna try this one out. <laughs> for $13 for a bait, yeah, I'm gonna try it out. And it's straight from Japan, and the Japanese really, really take their bass fishing seriously. Like, I thought over in America we took it serious, but in Japan they take it real serious. Anything else in here? Ah. This right here. This little tube is full of garlic scent. Fish love it. Fish love garlic, they love coffee, they love salt. This right here, just snip this right here, take a little bit of it and put it on something like like this crank or something like this or any type of like hard bait or something like that. Give it a little bit of smell to go with the action. You know, fish come in and get it. They come in and get it. And that looks like that's all from the mystery taco box. So not a bad deal, not a bad deal. I advise everybody, if you're a fisherman and you like to fish and you want different baits every month, baits that are actually gonna work, you know, Go ahead and try out Mystery Tackle Box. I'm going to leave a link in the description down under here so y'all can link in with it. And it's, I think, I don't know, but usually when you first tried it out, like when I first tried it out, my first box was five bucks with shipping and handling and everything. But I think that came down to like maybe 
seven or eight bucks all together, which isn't bad. Then it's like 15, 20 bucks a month after that, and you get well over $20 worth of, you know what I'm saying, baits and stuff. This is like a real good deal. So, I like it. I really like it a lot. Not a bad mystery tackle box this month. Can't wait to see what the next one's gonna look like next month. I might switch it up and switch over to panfish for a little while for next month. See what I get on that. Mm -hmm. But that was the mystery tackle box. So it's raining right now. It's really pouring down cats and dogs. But I really just want to upload a video, get a video up for you guys so y'all can see, you know, what I got in the mail from the mystery tackle box. And, you know, just give y'all some information on mystery tackle box because it's, it's a cool system. I like it. I like it a lot. But right now, I'm really just getting off work. It is 9.05 in the morning. And I have to get some sleep. I've been at work since 9 o'clock yesterday. Last night, I should say. I'm pooped. So, yeah. I will talk to y'all later. After I post this video, I'm going to bed. So, night everybody. Or morning some, night for some. Me, I'm going to bed. Talk to y'all in a minute. Ready Fisherman signing out. Remember. It's always a good day when you're fishing.